Hello trader and welcome to Mubyte. Is this your first time connected Mubyte challenge to the Bybit? Or are you connecting multiple Mubyte challenges to Bybit? Well, in this video, we'll dive into how to set up Bybit accounts and Bybit sub accounts. So listen in. Okay, so upon registration on Bybit and purchasing a challenge, you'll see a tab in your dashboard to set up needed. This means that you'll need to connect your Mubyte challenge to the Bybit account, potentially Bybit sub account. So we'll look into how to set up the Bybit sub account. Uh, we'll go into the Bybit dashboard and we'll log in with our uh, registered account. So you need to have a registered Bybit account, but this account does not need to be KYC. Again, it does not need to be KYC. If you are operating for European Union at this moment, you just don't click the view announcement, just click go back to homepage and you stay on Bybit.com. So currently Mubyte only supports Bybit.com. Bybit EU will be coming later on at the end of 2025. So I come back to the homepage. If I'm at the homepage, I can see uh, in the right top corner, my accounts. Then I can see my uh, recently used accounts and those are the sub accounts of the main account. So basically what I can do here is that I can have multiple Mubyte challenges and I can connect them to multiple sub accounts from Bybit. So let's say, let's see how we can do this. Uh, I come into the switch and create account. And here we can see that I already have test one and test two. And I created these for just demonstration, but we'll walk through the process of creation a sub account right now together. So I click on create. When I click on create, I can see that I give it a name. So let's go um, test three. I can't use uh, special characters, no spaces allowed. Uh, it's too long, so let's do kind of thing, move by and um, I want this account to be unified trading account. I don't need to require password for logging at the moment, but so I'll just confirm. And I have, uh, I will receive a notification into my Gmail account. And in my Gmail, I just confirm, I authenticate with a code, I paste it back in. And now I have confirmed the account. So the account has been created successfully. And now it'll prompt me into adding funds. Since we're trading on demo, we don't need to add funds, so we'll skip this. And I can switch to the sub account. Then in the right top corner, I can see that I'm on the sub account of the main account that we logged into previously. And I have the uh, testing account that we just set up. Then I have the test two, test three, etc. And now there comes the second part and I will be connecting to Mubyte dashboard. So when I go to demo trading um, on the little T on top, or there will be a little man. Here I have start trading with 100K. This sometimes comes up in the challenge. So whenever that comes up, just go on the top, refresh the page. So you'll navigate to the right top corner and you'll see API. And here you simply create API keys. The API key process is quite simple. You just click on system generated keys. You give it the name Mubyte. You go read and write permission, no IP restrictions, unify trading account, assets, submit. It's quick, quick, easy, simple. I just copy the API key, come here, connect Bybit account, put in the API key. I copy the API secret, take that, put it in here, test connection. Upon validation, I see credentials validated successfully. I click connect. And now I just wait until Mubyte does everything for me. So whenever uh, this connects, so I can see that I bought a 625 instant funding. I see that in the funded challenges and I go view challenges detail. Here I can see all my matrices, the Bybit account has been connected. I can then track my statistics, analytics and all that, all that fancy stuff. I do understood. And then when I go into assets, I can actually see in the unified assets that um, the 625 has been added to my account and the 100,000 that we had problems with previously got deleted. So whenever that comes up, just get that and we will later delete it and Mubyte does the work for you for connecting the account. And whenever you're getting more challenges, let's say 10 Mubyte challenges, you need to connect all those challenges to different sub accounts. So you would follow that process that I mentioned previously. You would look through all the sub accounts. You create 10 different sub accounts and the 10 different sub accounts will be connected to the 10 different challenges on Mubyte. And in this way, you can make sure that there will be no API problems and that trading will run smoothly on the Mubyte platform. Whenever you need any help, contact us at support at Mubai.com or on the live chat or Discord. Thank you for trading with Mubai. Be part of the team.